So I've got my clay here, all right? One thing we wanna do is make sure we get rid of that canvas texture that's on there from the slab roller. You know, that's one of my pet peeves. I hate it when I see the canvas texture. It's just lazy if you don't get rid of it. Um, so please make sure we smooth that out. Very simply, take a wet sponge, get your clay wet, Take your blue rib really quickly, just go over it a couple of times back and forth, and that should smooth it out, all right? If you want, you can go a couple different directions, but one or two directions should be fine. Now, make sure that you do this to both sides. So I'm gonna take, pick this up very carefully, try to keep it as flat as possible, all right? So that I can get to the back side. The back side will become either the inside or the outside of your mug, so therefore we wanna make sure that it is nice and smooth. If it's not, okay, then you're gonna have that canvas texture there and either A, you'll see it through the glaze or B, it'll be a texture on your hand or something that we don't necessarily want, all right? So now what we wanna do is once we've got our slab rolled out, we need to make our rectangle. Yes, you're gonna start by making a rectangle that we're gonna wrap around one of our tubes. Um, and therefore, that's going to determine how big our mug is going to be, all right? And I'll show you that in the next one.